and I'm gonna film it. I don't know if I'll play it for you, but because I don't know when I edit the clip what's gonna be in there or not. What's gonna make the cut. All right, let's get to it, shall we? I'll be back. Good morning, people. It is Sunday morning, January 10th, 9.39 a.m. I only know that because I looked at the clock. So I'm still in my sweater robe. Uh, yeah, it's just one of those kind of mornings. No rush to get dressed. Anyway, I have an excess of sourdough starter right now. Um, and if you don't believe me, yeah, so I'm getting tired of throwing it away. And so this morning we're going to make a couple of things, but we're going to start off with a batch of sourdough cinnamon buns. This is a recipe from the King Arthur Flower website. And my sourdough starter is also from their website, so I'll try to find the recipe links for both recipes and link them below. I'm also probably going to make at least one batch of bread slash rolls. That uses up a couple cups of starter too, I think. So that hopefully I have to throw less away, maybe. All right, let's get to cooking. I'll be back. Okay, I had just enough flour to make one batch of bread, AKA rolls. They're proofing in the oven right now because the oven's a warm place. I live in the Pacific Northwest and it's a bit chilly um, for proofing bread anyways. Uh, and the cinnamon roll dough is on its first stage of doing its thing and I need to babysit it for like the next four hours, so that's fine. I have just enough flour to finish the cinnamon rolls. I had enough to do the bread dough, the cinnamon rolls, and feed the starter, and then I have enough left for the floured board rolling out cinnamon roll things later, because evidently I didn't know I was this low and I didn't put it on the list, so it's on there now. Hey guys, it is Monday, um, January 11th, 1.13 p.m. Don't get excited, I'm looking at the iPad. Um, I spent the morning uh, editing the vlog and getting the three hours worth of video clips down to something that was less than 30 minutes, so that took up most of the morning. Anyway, then this morning, while I was editing or saving the video, I was purging mark making tools. I had a box of mark making tools. I don't think I've touched any of them since I moved two and a half years ago. And so I am gonna be purging a bunch of them. That'll be in the January Use It or Lose It video of, that'll air sometime next month. And I got them, hold on, let's move the camera. So I got the ones that I'm keeping in the large Lazy Susan here with the, my acrylic paint brushes. So all of my mark making tools are in there. I have some watercolor and gouache brushes that traditionally are up against that wall there, actually in that empty space right there. I wanna be able to use them more. I also know for a fact there's brushes in here I don't like using. I don't enjoy using them, they're not my thing, and I got talked into getting them for various reasons. They need to go, I know some of them have never been used, and they're not gonna be, to be honest. 
And even if I want to try them, they're not going to get tried being way over there. Um, and I have some newer sort of gouache, gouache brushes. Um, so, and I, I do want to keep them separated, but I want to have them here at the table. Um, I filled up two of the drawers in my new organiza organization system with pencils. And I'm thinking now that I just need one of pencils and one of maybe watercolor brushes or one of watercolor brushes and one of gouache brushes and a few pencils that I'm gonna keep out in a different place. So I'm gonna be reorganizing that whole system. And... Morning, everybody. It is 9.38 a.m. Tuesday, January 12th. Yes, I had to look at the computer. Where have you been? <laughs> of course I did. Um, we are getting ready to go live on YouTube. We're going to do a little painting. I think I'm going to do some botanical painting, and I did a few botanicals the other day and turned them into sticker flakes. I think I'm going to go get those particular paintings out of the other room, and we're going to do some more of those little paintings because I'm just feeling it. So anyway, um, got business emails that have come in this morning and contracts to look over and all the things for the things because of the things. So it's going to be kind of a busy day, I think. And I want to film a couple of videos for my creative year and a life of art and self-expression, my two Facebook groups. If you're not a member of one or both and you'd like to be, the links are down below along with my email newsletter and my Etsy shop and my um, link to the Art Foamies page with my designs on it and all the things. So check it out. All right, I'm going to go get those paintings. I'll be back.
Hey guys, technically I can still say good morning <laughs> because it's 11.47 a.m. Wednesday, January 13th. I uh, edited a couple of videos that I filmed yesterday for my two, one for each Facebook group. They're loading to YouTube Unlisted right now and the links will be shared on Friday in the two groups. If you want to see those videos and you want the links, go join the Facebook groups. The links are down below in, in my link tree, also in my link tree list, list of links, which is down below. Go check it out. I have an email newsletter. I've got an Etsy store. I've got Patreon. All the things for the things. In fact, for Patreon, we have Friday Zooms. They do get recorded for the people who can't come. And then um, those videos are also unlisted. So, yeah. Um. It's Friday, uh, Thursday morning. It is not Friday yet. It's Thursday morning, January 14th, I think. And it's just before 8 a.m. Hold, hold the phone. <laughs> hold the phone. Hang on. Isn't that pretty? Sunrise. Anyway, I'm out and about getting some steps in. My husband drove over because he's got to be back quickly. We both are going to the dentist this morning for cleanings. Um, I, I don't. I like my dentist, but let's hope it's just a cleaning. 
<laughs> those that don't know, every time I go to the dentist, they find something else to fix. I have five crowns and counting. Let's hope I don't get any more right now. Anyway, um, so I have time. My appointment's not until nine o'clock. His is at eight. So he's driving over and he's got to be back quickly. I have time. So I'm going to walk over and walk back and get some steps in. So I'll take you with me. I'll be back. Okay, so the good news is my teeth are fine. Uh, no issues. The only issue that is with my teeth is not anything health-wise wrong and not my fault. <laughs> um, so one of my new crowns, the one on the root canal I just had done not long ago, is um, not seated exactly right. It's literally like a hair off. So they are out of Abundant, an abundance of precautions going to remove that crown on the, in a couple weeks and get me seated up and fitted up with a new one that hopefully is going to be seated correctly so that tooth is kind of an issue uh, I'm really hoping not to lose the tooth at some point because they can't get it covered right but we'll see alright but otherwise all good so I'm going to walk home have another cup of coffee and some breakfast. I'll be back. All right, I've been back home for quite a while. Um, <clears throat> dental appointment went fine. I think I said that already. Anyway, we are now uh, making, <laughs> my husband says, what are you cooking? I'm all um, rusty metal and avocado seeds <laughs> uh, and skins. So we're making some more DIY dye or ink and um, I brought it to a boil and I'm gonna let it simmer low and slow for at least a couple of hours. This is a pot, by the way, that's dedicated for this kind of thing. I do not cook food in this. So it's a pot I picked up for, I think, $3 or $4 at the thrift shop. So I'd recommend doing that if you're gonna try this. Anyway, it's about... Hey guys, how are you today? It is Friday. Friday, January 15th, I believe. It is 12.53 p.m. If my clock, car clock is accurate. But no guarantees. everybody it's just after lunch on Saturday January 16th it is my dad's birthday he's 80 oh crap two, two I think I think he's 82 because I think he's 10 years younger than your mom um 80 something uh anyway so happy birthday dad we are headed out obviously we're in the car again um, we're going to try to get our weekly grocery shopping done and try to do it enough so that we don't have to go out again to anywhere until after Wednesday Inauguration Day because I have a feeling the political climate around the nation is going to be strained until then. I think Fred agrees with me. Um, but we do have to go down to downtown to Main Street. We're turning on Main Street now. I need to check the P.O. box. Which I'm really 
really bad about doing. Um, so yeah, so we're gonna do that. Kind of curious about what it's gonna look like down here, if anything's gonna still be boarded up or windows broken or, I don't know, I guess we'll find out. Anyway, we're gonna get some stuff done and I'll be back. Okay, so it's a bit later than I thought we'd be doing this, but we still are headed, out. huh? Still light out. Still light out though, yeah, it's not four o'clock yet. So we're headed out for a walk get some steps in before it does get dark because it's a novel idea these days to go walking without a flashlight. <laughs> anyway, we need to get some steps in besides what we'd got in at the grocery store. The creek is really full again. There we go. It's just like a couple doors down from the house. Anyway, we are gonna go for a walk and get some steps in, see what we can see. We'll bring you with us when we can and I will be back. Okay guys, it's just about dinner time on Saturday evening, so I wanna close the vlog out here. I have been trying some new things on the YouTube channel, so let me know if you've seen them, let me know if you like them. Um, I have a couple more ideas for them too coming up. They're called YouTube Shorts, and they're just short little, less than a minute long videos. Um, YouTube's way of, I think, competing with TikTok, but anyway, we're gonna try them and see if they increase views and you know help my channel out. And so far, so good. So if you're out there and you're watching and you have a YouTube channel, think about creating one. If you don't know what they are, um, you can private message me. You can also just search it on YouTube. There's a lot of videos on how to make them, how to edit them and all of that stuff and how to get them loaded. Um, YouTube shorts, uh, anyway, yeah. Uh, it's been another, interesting week <laughs> you know yeah so anyway I hope you've enjoyed this vlog and if you have any ideas for things specific that you'd like to see again I do have some ideas that I need to work on some of them starting tomorrow and so look forward to some new content and it, but if you need if you have something specific let me know uh, don't forget to check out the video description for relevant links and including my Instagram and the Etsy shop. Check out ways to support the channel and the free content here on YouTube and over in the Facebook art groups. Um, there is a link tree list of links in the video description. Uh, and if you click on that, there's a whole bunch of stuff there. So check it out. Um, if you have a favorite content creator, check out their video links and see what they have in their video description. Maybe they have a way that you can support them look into it. I know they'd appreciate it, as, I, as would I. Don't forget to please stay safe, stay healthy, stay creative. Please wear a mask and go out and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. We'll see you next week. Bye, guys.